Let's Burn with Brigands presents The Wheel of Death. Hey everybody, Wheel of Death was early this time, but we are playing Let's Burn with Brigands versus Jeopardy, the junior edition, so I might have a chance. And we have a built-in rule for this one, because there's just so many variables when it comes to Jeopardy. There's a lot of answers people are getting right and wrong constantly uh so every time the other player selects the most valuable clue the bottom row clue one of those categories on the bottom row or values then we advance the spiciness increasingly spicy hot sauce so let's give her a spin to appease the wheel of death and there you go let's get into it feel free to help me out or tell me after the fact how wrong or poorly I did. From Game Tech, by which we also mean, I think Rare is involved. Yeah, Rare was making all these games. Recently played Taboo from Rare, the strangest of those games, actually, uh, that they design when it comes to these kind of board game, card games, what have you. But here you go, Jeopardy! A first on Let's Burn with Brigands. The Junior Edition. Just us. Easy. It's going to be a lot of 80s clues to make this hard enough as it is. Justice. And we always name our character here on Let's Burn with Brigands, Bernie. With a U. Just enough space there. Pretty sure this kid was also on Family uh, Wheel of Fortune, as we did that before. I think maybe that's what we want. That kid doesn't have any eyes. It's like Brock Purdy. Not that Brock Purdy doesn't have any eyes. Maybe a dated reference now. Oh, like, and then they, like, change the tint of the characters. I don't know, that's a sneaky way to get some more... characters options. I don't know, we'll be this guy. Bernie, Diane, and Trisha. Right. Bernie, choose category. Word turns, animal people. Sing a song, I like that. Board games, I like that too. Volcanoes and cartoon foods. All right up my alley. Let's go cartoon foods for 100. This vegetable gives Popeye his strength. Well, we just did a Let's Burn episode on this. So I happen to know. The timing is uncanny, actually. That Popeye is all about his spinach. What is spinach? Alright, let's uh, go cartoon foods for 200. Bugs Bunny is always munching on these. Feel free to buzz in any time, Diane or Trisha. I happen to know. Bugs Bunny loves his carrots. Heck yeah. Thank you, Alex. Cartoon foods for 300. Wimpy and Jughead are crazy over these. Oh, man. Wimpy and Jughead, what are they always eating? Hamburgers! Yeah, I didn't, uh... Mono knew. Everybody knew hamburgers. I'm sorry, I... What, this is Snoopy's favorite soft drink? Snoopy drinks soda? Was this like a marketing campaign? Oh, root beer. Damn it, just like that. After I get two right, Diane's in front. I will gladly pay you Tuesday. This is the opening at the top of vol a volcano. The opening at a top of a volcano. The cra crater. Oh, of course. If you want to get technical, Alex. What else would they... A cowardly kid? Animal people. <gasps> Chicken! Caldera, right? That was gonna like cowardly kid. I found my category here. <laughs> what is a wimp? You know the majestic wimp that you can keep as a as a pet. 
Wait, what? Cowardly kid. I said chicken. Did I not put chicken? Frady cat. What? F you, Trisha. Are you serious? I'd say chicken is used about a thousand more times than scaredy cat. Or it's not even freight. Yeah, it's not even freighty cat. It's scaredy cat. An automobile mechanic, grease monkey. I was, I was still fuming over the last question. That should have been. That should have been chicken. No one calls me chicken. Makes this go down. All right, I gotta get back in the game. <laughs> Two thumbs up. Medicine. Just shh. Tune in for just me shouting medicine. Medicine! <laughs> I hate Trisha. Alright, I'm back in control. Let's do animal people for 400 and see how I can get this one wrong. Oh, all my money. All 300. 299. A grump. A grumpy person. Oscar the Grouch? That's not an animal person, though. A grumpy person? A bear? Grumpy person. He's not an animal, though. You're being a real... You're being a real lion today? What is it? Oh, my money! Ah. Sourpuss! Oh. Sourpuss, I thought this was the junior. Oh, I get to go again. Alright, that category's burned me too many times. No pun intended. Sing a song! Little Tommy Tucker sang for this. His supper. Even I know this. Even Bernie's got this one. Supper. What? It's supper. Curds and whey? It was supper. This game is all kinds of rigged. Man, I thought... His supper? This is for children. You're gonna be that anal about it? That's messed up. His supper. Oh. They, sh they should have been cool, man. In this game, you eliminate your opponent's pieces by jumping them. <laughs> I owe Alex Trebek $200. Oh, God. How am I going to screw this one up now? Second guessing everything. Oh, we're back in the black. All right. I want to go big, but I'll leave those for the ladies. This is the most expensive property on a Monopoly board. Boardwalk, not park place. It's like, I should be beating these children. Just got me on that. Just like that, we're back in first. I don't know what word turns is. A Michael Jackson hit album turns around to become a little bit... Bad? Oh my god. Someone give Diane medical attention. She just had a little vomiting kind of episode there. I'm not sure what that was. Dab? Bad and dab? Oh! I didn't understand. Alright, I know the category. No, no, go back. I can do that. Alright. Climbing up and down and sliding down are two ways to move in this game. This would be shoots and ladders. Uh, it's not even worth typing out for a hundred dollars. Man.
man, it's not worth the effort. Snakes and arrows, kid. I want more word turns now that I understand the category. It does say pan and nap. A black, sticky road surface turns around to become a road. No, I have this! Ah, oh, Diane! Tar and rat. I wonder if I'd put rat and tar. Is she eating something? That's very disrespectful. Oh, stand by. She picked the bottom row. It's the An ambitious reporter. Of oh, animal people. If you can take this one back. An ambitious reporter? Maybe quit your... A news hound? I'll go with news hound, because I've kind of heard that. Is it one word or two? They're gonna... They're gonna tar me if I get this wrong. Wolf Blitzer. Is it one word or two? Frady Cat was like a thing earlier. I'm gonna go with two words. Good job. All right, 1100 bucks. Let's go board games for 200. Checkmate is a term used in this game. That would be the game of chess. That's what I'm currently playing right now. I don't think, you know, I was just throwing you off the scent with those uh, mistakes I made earlier, even though Supper should have been perfectly acceptable. Volcanoes for 400. A volcano that hasn't erupt, erupt in years, but may still do so, is called this. Dormant? Alex? Dormant volcano? As in lies dormant? 17 hundy! <laughs> what is Video Games 101? Let's go 400 for Sing a Song. If you sing a song of sixpence, this many blackbirds are in a pie. Oh god, I, I, I don't know. I know vaguely 24, I don't know. Why are you making a bird uh, based pie? That's what I want to know. 4 and 20. Good call. This musical note is a female deer. No. Too grand. Buzz in at any point, other two of you. Everybody knew. Uh, let's go 200. The child spinning toy, top pot. Top and pot. There was an and, right? This is my game. The beauty of Children's Jeopardy is if you kick butt at this, People won't know if you would have done just as well at Adult Jeopardy or not. They have to assume you probably could because you're doing so well at this. But they don't really know for sure. So it's just sort of like... It's smart. <laughs> it's it's the right version to play when you're streaming. Uh, animal people for two, hundy. An inconsiderate driver. Turkey! Oh, I hope it's turkey. My mom always calls poor drivers turkeys. We kind of make fun of her for it, so I hope it's turkey. No, it's not turkey! What is it then? Roadhog! A selfish driver, I think, would be Roadhog, because you're hogging up the road. You heard me say that, Diane. Fine. Pick an expensive clue. And, uh, round two. Special songs you sing on December 25th? Not hard to get like, through. Oh, the, like carols? Round two. Is that holiday songs? Carols? Do they have to be Christmas carols? Because I'll be so upset. I bet they are a Christmas carol. I'm just going to put carol and hope that's enough.
Hell yeah. Uh, volcanoes for 300? Melted rock deep in the earth is called this. Melted rock. Like hot magma. We're not talking about like igneous rocks. Which are the products of... Let's go word turns for 100. You are destroying these children. An underwater boat turns around to become a large motor vehicle. Sub and bus. Again, it's not worth for me to type it out. Oh, there is an ampersand, isn't there? Alright, well, whatever. I didn't see anyone else using it. Hold the phone there. Alright. Yeah, feeling pretty good about smoking these kids. Ah, oh, don't worry about that. Ooh. Tangy. Go from desk to desk in this board game race to answer the questions and graduate? Is it life? I don't know. <laughs> what the fudge is that? It wouldn't even fit. Never heard of the head of the class. A specific state is made up of volcanic islands. Made up of volcanic islands. Hawaii! Man, now I gotta pick one. Doesn't count if I pick one. Let's go cartoon foods. I missed this category. This Italian dish is Garfield's favorite food, lasagna! Lasagna! I say it that way to remind myself how it's spelled. Oh, I could I'd crush a lasagna right now. Word turns for 500, Alex. Money left for waiters turns around to become saliva. Oh, salvia? I read that as saliva. Tip and hit. Oh, tips and spit. <laughs> it said salvia. <laughs> These kids are crushing me. Salvia. Damn it. I got too eager. Oh, that was a bad one. I've heard of tips. Salvia. It's Washington Island. Our Washington State volcano has erupted. It was, um... Olympus? Helens? Mount St. Helens? Do they care about the whole thing? Can I get away with just St. Helens? Yeah, you gotta remember, every you gotta take it all with a, uh... It's close enough. It was worth losing $500 over. Come on, kid. Clean up. Mount Helens? What did I say? St. Helens? Hate who is in charge of Brady Bunch. All right. Tom Sawyer. I don't know about that. U.S. States. The home state of Jimmy Carter and the Atlanta Braves. If you had left it at Jimmy Carter, I'm not sure. Georgia. Trish is actually embarrassingly close to my score. Starts with H. I need money. 
A cape off the coast of North Carolina. I just don't know how to spell this. It's Hatteras. I'm gonna say it's like this. 800 bucks! Wait, I don't, I don't want that. I didn't even see the question. The 50th state to join the United States. Uh, uh that... Is that Alaska or Hawaii? Yeah, it's Hawaii. Look at that. I don't even need to see the question to know. Well, I did in that case. Brady Bunch! I bet it's Alice. I mean, Jan had... All, all the Brady girls had blonde hair. What are, you, are you trying to trip me up? Oh, that's about... Alaska. Uh, Tom Sawyer. I don't know anything about Tom Sawyer. She was a relative who took care... Aunt Polly? Is that right? Aunt Polly? Painting it, I know. Don't mess with me with no Aunt Bess. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I remember that from the, uh, I guess from the book, but mostly the game, the painting fence game. Animal family? A mother elephant. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not good with these. Diane apparently found her. Oh, a cow. Yeah, I'm gonna stay away from that category. Don't take that as like a... Uh, baby horse. You got foal. Were you trying to say foal? But you went... Fool! As it's short... I'll go. 200 bucks. Let's get some top cheese here. U.S. states for 800. The potato state. Come on now. Yeah, I was gonna... I, I didn't wanna... You know when they start saying F.O., you can generally guess what the rest of it is. Idaho potatoes. Yeah, Diane, I think sh they should bring on the Jeopardy medical team. Heavy beam used as a weapon to break down castle doors and walls. Hey, uh... Battery man. And Ray! She's like, I'm just Trisha. I don't know, I just... Things just work out for me. The approach to a castle that could be raised or lowered. Like drawbridge? Like drawbridge? The portcullis! Man, the portcullis. Man, when's Kingdom Come 2 coming out? That's what I want to know. I'm in charge again. Well, let's go back to Brady Bunch, my area of expertise. The theme song tells the story of a man named Brady and this type of lady. Probably lovely. A lovely lady. Nice lady. Sweet. Uh, 400? She was the oldest female Brady child. Everyone knows Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Everybody had a crush on her. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. I don't think you guys can catch up now. I'll finish out the Brady Bunch category. The kids were this many kids on the Brady Bunch. Six. And then they tweaked it ever so slightly on step by step. Instead of having three boys, the dad had two boys and a girl, who was kind of a tomboy. Uh, let's try more Tom Sawyer that I won't know. Tom had to whitewash or paint this. Keep asking me questions that I can answer by playing that game. The chase on Tom Sawyer's island. He 
You guys can go home now. Ladies. Pipe smoke and barefoot friend. Tom Sawyer and Huck. Man, don't make me type the whole thing. I don't know how this is spelled. Huckleberry Finn. Is that right? All right. I was I was like, it's the L after the E. I'll finish out Tom Sawyer. Tom Sawyer's girlfriend. Oh God, I don't even know. Was she the one that was with JTT in that movie back in the nineties? Becky Thatcher. Wasn't her dad like a lawyer or a, a judge? Judge Thatcher. Or is that a reality TV show? Starts with H. Uh, the gathering of crops. Harvest! I'm going for 10,000. I'm going to set the junior Jeopardy. Yeah, we're going to set the junior Jeopardy record of an adult beating the, the tar off of a bunch of kids. A green comic book character was a member of the Wasp family. The green Hornet. You all know. Brian, you know. What is a Hornet? Um, man, I don't know that much about... Oh, oh man, all the money. Yes. How'd you lose all your money, Bernie? Blew it all on Junior Jeopardy. What was the clue? It was... A water-filled trench around a castle. How do you spell moat? Is it A-T? Is that how you spell moat? I don't even know. I think that's right, but I don't know. Oh, God. When you, when you have $9,700 riding on something, your mind tends to go blank. Let me tell you. For those of you who've never been on Junior Jeopardy, yes! Ah, oh, $19,000! Alright! So we can get a nice even 20 grand with this one. The Garden State, home of the Meadowlands. My buddy Todd hails from this state. New Jersey. Only the strong survive. Do they still have that fake slogan? 20 20 grand. Yes. That's awesome. Great Salt Lake and Mormon Choir call this state home. Utah. A village in Utah. I don't know, but I dedicated that clue and answer to Ogent Toad for 20 grand. Um, I'm locked into castles now. During this period in history that most castles were built. I don't know, the Dark Ages? The feudal? The feudal period? What what do they want here? The Middle Ages? The, the mi Middle Ages? We feel good about Middle Ages? Medieval? I don't... Oh, God. Medieval? Man, they're going to dick me. I bet it is middle, medieval, but I already started writing Middle Ages. Yay! They might have taken both, for all I know. The first president of the Republic of Texas with a city named for him. Houston? Sam Houston? Yeah, I, w I wouldn't have known his name. I do know... I know it's not a category. Hold on. We have a... But I'm pretty good at math, and I know that 20,000 is more than whatever they have right now. Oh!
murderer who tried to kill Tom. I think that I think his name is Joe. Yeah, do they want me to be offensive? Or can I just get by with Joe? Alright. Rocking it. Yeah, strictly for, um, to be authentic to the book and to make this money, we have to put this in. He chases around Tom Sawyer's Island. Him and that lovable bear. Alright, I'm going to 1,000 on U.S. States. Oh, God. <laughs> I found them both. Go big or go home, right, Bernie? Twenty-two grand, man. I hope you uh, hope you got this money, Alex. I need help. The first state. Oh, um, Delaware. Is Delaware, the first state. Want to visit a screen door factory? Confirmation. Yeah? Feel okay. good? Delawarf! Oh, God! <laughs> Delawarf! I think it's Delaware. Oh, yeah! 44,000! Delawarf! <laughs> I saw it before I... before I committed to it. Oh, that would have been a nasty one, even by my standards. Of Peter and Greg, he was the older Brady son. Peter, Greg, and... Oh, of the two, um, Greg was the oldest. Just ask me... Just, just ask me who the oldest boy was. Alright, I don't... I'm not good at the animal names. Let's go back to castles. These soldiers defend at the castle. Like guards? Yeah. Oh, knights. Knights, thanks for your little outburst, Trisha. I'll take it. Neat. Knights, you say. That'll be 600 bucks. Oh. I mean, can I just, like... I could... Buy them plane tickets back to where they lost. I don't know. We just move on to the next. The father of the goose family. The father of the goose family? The gander. Goose for a gander. Alright. Gander. Yeah. The baby of a doe. Do a deer, a feet, a fawn. Alright, I'll put in fawn for how much is this? $600? Give me a nice round $4,700. Lovely lady from the Leisure Suit Larry series as well. Are they really making us do every single clue? I guess so. Testament to how fast we were going through this. Pen, cob, and signet belong to this. Family. Swans. I don't know. Dun, 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 dun. All right, we have to wager all forty-seven thousand dollars, right? We gotta walk out of the studio with ninety-four thousand dollars. Contestant with no winnings cannot take part. Technically, they could still win, since I am incredibly irresponsible with my money. Flying! I bet the answer is wings. Or birds. Or airplane. Yeah, we're all on pins and needles to find out what you're gonna wager, Diane. Seven hundred. That's very fiscally responsible of you, Diane. Or Trisha, whoever. He was the first person to fly solo across the Atlantic Ocean. Oh, um... Not, 
not the Wright brothers. Lindbergh? for the chorus for her today. No one's concerned about her concussed state? <laughs> it looks like it. That's right. Charles A. Lindbergh. I don't think they're going to be that stickler about it. Stickler-ish. Hooray! 94,000. I can buy all y'all. They both bet half their money. Which is good because they both had Serious medical episodes during their answers. <laughs> yeah, I own all of you. I'm gonna rename this show Bernadi. We'll workshop it. But. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and comment on this video, and click subscribe if you haven't already, as this seriously helps me to keep making great content for you. And check the description of this video to see what song is playing right now.